infinite banking case. It's a mom who has savings. So basically, you know, she found my channel. She started watching some of the Velocity banking videos, but what caught her eye most was the infinite banking videos. And then obviously additional research that she was doing. She wanted to basically have a place to store her savings other than a regular savings account at the bank where we're not going to earn really any money right on that account. So this will be a quick, quick case. So income 4,600 expenses, 3,747 total debt. Doesn't have a lot of debt, which is good. 82,855. Cash flow, not 800. Um, doesn't have a line of credit, but she does have 40K in savings. And here is would be an example of how some people that are, you know, I would say anxious to, you know, get into the whole IBC thing. Um, we designed basic 90-10 split policy, um, putting in 40000 for the first year, and then the following years, we don't know. There's only 800 in cash flow right now, so there's only so much I can work with, but she does have initial capital, and she wanted to throw that in to then borrow quite a bit of money to um, pay off some of that 82,000. And that can work. You just, you've just established about a 30 plus K line of credit, which we're gonna keep outstanding for quite some time. So the funding, okay, so we got a policy. We're gonna use Guardian. Premium is 4K, obviously, because we're putting in 40. Funding 40 and Death benefit is a little over a million. A million thirty-five K net cash value to start with is a little over thirty-five K. Their OIT, one year term insurance expense, is three hundred and fifty-six. So if I'm not mistaken, this woman is also planning on she has a business. Yeah, she's building a school from the ground up, private school in Africa. So that's, the, that's a big financial goal there. So here's what she's working on. Building a school in Africa. And we've got a cost. She has like 6K that she needs to spend over there. So as soon as this gets funded, which she just did recently. She funded the policy. She's gonna take 6K from the 40 in the policy, from the 35, I mean, the cash value, throw it towards the goal, and then another 10K, I believe, is gonna go towards some debt. Um, I have to get an update on her numbers in terms of what she has in specific debts, but I just wrote my notes. 10K is gonna get taken out of there to uh, tackle some debt. So we'll have about maybe 16K in policy loans. Maybe 16, max about 20K in policy loans, which we're gonna leave alone. Until she gets a line of credit, we can simply just send the cash flow each month to the policy or we can uh, send the entire income to the policy, take out an additional loan once per month to pay her bills, and just kind of like do like a little bit of a wash here. Could do that, or keep things simple, uh, just send cash flow to the policy each and every month. The goal is really not to pay this off right now, we're leveraging some of that money. We're trying to acquire a line of credit 
So that's another thing. When I would try to acquire a line of credit before the anniversary date so that we could potentially get more money, another 40K into that account. Another way she's going to bring in money is uh, through real estate. She's working on a property right now. Uh, and whatever profits come from that, we could just simply throw it in the policy. And she'll have plenty of space to do that. So even if come the anniversary date of the policy in 2020, if I only have 20K to work with, that's fine. I got 20K to work with. So I dump it in the at that time, get a line of credit, and then in between the next 12 months, I could have more money go in there, borrow from it, keep paying off more of that, more of that debt on the, on the personal side. And then this right here should bring in revenue for her and then the real estate as well. Um, so that was a, that's like a quick, quick example there. Not too much to talk about yet because um, I've yet to follow up with her, but I wanted to make sure I kind of get brought up to speed on what she's doing. Um, and then her and I are gonna conversate and make sure that she stays on task. <music>